Tonight on Revit Newsmakers, Ray Lovell, past president of the Fortuna Qantas Club, is here to talk about their upcoming Qantas pancake breakfast over these next two weekends. Hi, Ray. Hi, Ross. Uh, yeah, our pancake breakfast uh, is this coming weekend. Uh, it's over at Roner Park, mm -hmm. and from 7, 7 to 11, if you're a late riser, we'll still be pa be flipping pancakes. And then the following weekend, on Saturday and Sunday, we'll be having the pancake breakfast, the uh, same as before, Great pancakes, uh, lots of syrup, uh, butter, uh, sausage, the whole works. Who do you partner with for putting on these pancake breakfasts? Well, we partner with the Rodeo and the Auto Expo, and we've been doing it for the last 26 years. So it's a major event in the community. Mm -hmm. uh, lots and lots of people show up, don't they? Yeah, we flip over, well, we uh, a thousand meals uh, over the la three days of the, mm -hmm. uh, the pancake breakfast. Uh, do you find there's a difference in the crowds between uh, the auto people and the uh, cowboys and cowgirls? The, uh, yeah, the, um, the rodeo, the cowboys and cowgirls are much more hands-on. They're much more, they're on a budget, they're on a circuit, they're traveling around, and they eat more pancakes than the auto expo people. <laughs> <laughs> That's quite interesting. Uh, I want to ask you this. The Qantas International slogan is serving the children of the world. So how does your club help the kids in our area? As I mentioned, we're very much a hands-on club. During the course of the year, we have about 25 different events that we sponsor. Everything from toy drives to bike project, we collect old bikes and refurbish them and give them out to the schools to get in the put them in the hands of kids that wouldn't normally have, have uh, bikes. Uh, we do a spaghetti dinner um, for the uh, uh, 4-H clubs. We do a one-day Kiwanis where the community, we go out in the community and find a project the community needs, and our members then work on that project to bring it to fruition. We have a kindergarten reading. We have a 3rd of, 3rd of July uh, uh, fireworks uh, party wow. over at uh, Newburgh Park. Business swimming's luncheon. Um, oh, of course, the, uh, the pumpkin patch, too, right. which is right at Ray's at the, mm -hmm. in the parking lot there. You are raising the funds for other people. I mean, ultimately, yes, it's yes. not just for the Kiwanis Club. That it is, is to be given away. That's right. Every dollar that we raise, literally every dollar, goes back to the community. We give away on any given year about uh, anywhere between fifteen and twenty thousand uh, dollars. Individual grants, scholarships, a lot of scholarships, mm -hmm. uh, which is really that's what it's all about. Ray, can anyone join the Kiwanis Club? Oh, absolutely. We're always looking for men and women that would be interested in serving the community, helping out in our projects. If you care to, we'd love to invite you to one of our breakfasts. We meet every Tuesday morning over at Pepper's Restaurant uh, from 7 o'clock. Uh, it gets out about 8 so that people can get to work if they do work. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's just a lot of fun. I'll guarantee you'll have a good breakfast and you'll leave with a smile on your face. Okay, tell us again when the two pancake breakfasts are. Well, it's this Saturday morning, and then once again the uh, following weekend. Uh, and if you're a late bloomer or a late, late riser, you can come at uh, where we'll be serving breakfast till 11 o'clock. Ray Level from the Fortuna Qantas Club. I'll see you at Runner Park. Absolutely. Look forward to it and bring your friends.